concert field, Hannibal, if you worked at it. Oh, you're so right, Jeffrey. Golden fingertips. I simply surveyed the remnant of them. I'm a rag. <laughs> oh, do come in, Mrs. Savage. Uh, I trust you had a pleasant sleepless night. Lovely, thank you. Not a wink. You just missed Hannibal's recital. No, I heard it. Actually, it's what brought me out of my room. <laughs> you wouldn't believe it, Mrs. Savage, but Hannibal never touched a violin until last year. <coughs> oh, what makes you think I wouldn't believe it, dear? <laughs> Is it something you composed yourself, Hannibal? Uh, 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 Bach, with variations of my own. Mathematics loss was certainly our game. Now, I don't quite follow that, Fairy. Uh, fairy knows that I used to be a statistician. Oh, now I'm straight. Give him a fraction to multiply. Oh, I'm afraid I wouldn't know whether he was right or not. Uh, my, my last position was with the government charting trends. I was to keep my finger on the pulse of, of the public and my ear to the ground. Oh, a rather vulnerable position, was it not? Oh, oh, oh very. <laughs> I was fired and, and replaced with an electronic calculator. Oh, well, I should think that you would hate electricity, too. Oh, oh, no, no, not really. But I did want to make money using my brain, so I spent the next two years trying to come up with something that could be made for a penny and sold for a dollar and was habit for me. And afraid my education was wasted. I'm going to send Emily Ann to Vassar. Girls are not too bright, but they certainly are ladies. That reminds me, Mrs. Savage. May we ask you a personal question? They're the only ones worth asking, my dear. Well, a little bird told us that you used to be an actress. We're just bursting with curiosity, is it true? Oh, that. Well, if being on stage makes you an actress, then I guess it's true. Miss Willie, that's the bird Florence mentioned, said that you were on the New York stage. I wonder if we've ever seen you, Miss Savage. Well, you would have had to be quick. <laughs> Actually, I was only in two plays. The first one was Macbeth. I adore Macbeth. All that blood. I sent a pint of me own blood to the Red Cross once. They sent it back. <laughs> I should think you'd make a novel departure as Lady Macbeth, Mrs. Savage. Well, I can't tell you how much I agree with you. But they cast me as a witch. <gasps> but you're the perfect witch! Oh, thank you, my dear. Speaks of witch talk for us? I didn't have any minds. If I did, it probably would have cost me twice as much. Why did it cost you anything? Well, I backed the show. If I hadn't put up the money, I probably wouldn't even have been cast as a mute witch. But we made history. It's the first play that closed before the reviews were out. <laughs> Was it expensive? Extremely, but worth it. What a pity. Weren't you discouraged? Visually, but, but man is by nature optimistic. If he weren't, he'd eat his young. So I decided to write a play and star myself. You wrote a play? Indeed I did. With a courage born of ignorance and a plot out of wedlock. What part did you play? Naturally, the lead. Not guilty. Starring Ethel P. Savage. Um, what does the, the P stand for? I haven't the slightest. <laughs> but my numerologist told me to put it in for luck. He was right. We ran a year. What was the play about? It was about a mother who murdered a man and was defended by a young woman lawyer who <coughs> turned out to be her own daughter. I had red hair. And I died in my daughter's arms every night and two matinees a week. As the curtain came down and the jury whispered, not guilty. I never had a better time in my life. I gather the reviews were, were quite good that time. Well, they were sincere, but it didn't make any difference. Well, what did they say? Because 
trying to say, Mrs. Savage? They said that I had a tenacious mediocrity, unhampered by taste. But that wasn't good. It was perfect. In the ads, we simply read, tenacious and unhampered. And you ran for a year. We would have ran longer if my daughter hadn't come home and stopped me. I knew I wasn't good, and the audiences only came to laugh at me. But we both had a good time. What more can you ask? I do miss it. Well, my turn is coming. I don't think that was very nice of your daughter. Chance. 
chanting. It's, it's just, it's, it's just what? Oh, please, don't say anything mean. Oh. Tyrant! We have to go, Mrs. Savage. Oh, but where? It's garden hour. We each have a little pot, and we plant things. We can plant vegetables or flowers, anything. Last time, I planted a bird seed to see what would come out. What did come up? Nothing. But it was a rich horticultural experience. <laughs> There's a, a beautiful evergreen in the center, and every Christmas it has lights that say Merry Christmas. Keep out. <laughs> come with us, 